All right, time to wrap up yet another stage here, stage two, goal four. And this is, of course, where we first encounter the PR requirement. Um, but before we get there, this is one of those challenges where you need to maintain that target average speed when you cross the finish line each lap. Right, so three laps. So that's uh, three times. And as you can see, PR 56 is required. All right, so here we go. 133 is what we need to be hitting each time we finish a lap. And from the very get go. Oh, nice. Maybe light on the brakes makes a big difference, doesn't it? without the ranks being shown is a little annoying. Nice to know where I am, but uh, I think I might be considering that I'm beginning to lap opponents. I must be in first place. Right? Maybe. Alright, so one thirties I think we have uh, quite a buffer. Drive like these box A, drive some horrific lines. Oh, final lap. Oh. Missed the timing there a bit. Coming a little too hot, I think. seconds and change so actually improved on that lap time didn't we all right and that will get us another 589 uh, driver experience points driver xp sort of like your windows xp <laughs> and the uh, finishing first will get us out of 13,950 motorsport dollars, which is going to be a familiar number. I think we're going to see repeatedly uh, throughout this event as we win these uh, challenges. Right. So 56.861 is uh, now the target to beat for me personally. Um, But for now, that is uh, 
completion of stage two. Some extra motorsport dollars to earn 35,000. Once again, that is uh, separate from the daily earning cap. So that's all good. And then another five gold. Right, and that's practice done. We've managed to fit in our full schedule, so the team are in a great position to formulate a strategy for qualify and the race. Impressive driving. Don't get too comfortable, though. We'll be out there very soon for qualifying, which is going to be the next stage, stage three, right? Uh, you've got some downtime. Uh, have a think about your energy management and where the best spots are to recharge the battery. Right. Uh, unlike practice, you won't have a safety net in qualifying or the race. Right. Makes sense. So let's take a peek in the stage three qualifying. Qualifying time in Formula E teams are divided into four groups of six cars this frees up space on the track for you to do your best possible lap right because there are 12 teams up um each team with two cars so the in the final race stages once we get there uh, we're gonna have a grid of um let's see is it just 24 cars I swear there's more than 24 cars. I guess we'll see. Um, but anyway, uh, what do we have? This does not, this does come at the cost of one important thing is time. We have six minutes to get out on track, blah, 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 blah. Right, warm up tires and set the best lap. Um, top times will get put into one lap shootout. I'm sure we'll be able to get you there. Okay, so we'll continue on with qualifying stage, stage three, in the next video. So stay tuned. I'll see you guys soon.